what's going on everyone thank you so much for tuning in to another trailer reaction this one is for dumbo the official trailer the last trailer we got i believe that was just a teaser but um i like dumbo everybody like dumbo i'm excited for dumbo so let's check out some dumbo so i got on these headphones and now y'all can stop listening to me talk and watch me watch this trailer here we go I wonder if he's gonna fly. Welcome, baby Dumbo. We're all family here. No matter how small. <laughs> it's cute. <laughs> Very good, see <CGI>. John. <laughs> it's pretty dope. <laughs> Imagination of Timber. You have something very rare. You have wonder. Wow. You have That's mystique. Not. You have magic. What's up, DeVito? Come with me. Together, we can soar on that elephant's wings. Soar on the elephant's wings. What's happening? Where are they taking her? Take Dumbo back inside. But she's his mom. Do something. She needs us. Look at me. We're gonna bring Dumbo your mom. He doesn't look like magic to me. need you to believe in them. <laughs> Feeling this. Can you tell? You can do it, Dumbo. Show him. Are they at one arm? Fly. Baby of Aaron Kruger, no! It ruined the whole thing. Aaron Kruger sucks, man. I think that's the dude. He popped on the scene for me, I think, in 2009 with uh, Transformers 3, Transformers Dark of the Moon. Aaron Kruger. Yep, you sure did, buddy. I am not a fan of your writing. I'm not. I I'm not. I mean, you, you, you look at his filmography, he's attached to a lot, but like... Well, uh, no, I'm I'm just not. Um, you did tra you wrote Transformers three, four, and five. You wrote Ghost in the Shell. Uh, oh Lord, I can't even get excited for this movie now. That if he is he the only writer? I hope not. Helen, who is? He okay, Helen Avery. Okay, she wrote the uh, the novel, and she's not here anymore. She passed at ninety one years old in nineteen ninety nine. Of course, you know. Never mind. But damn. That just killed my vibe, you know what I'm saying? But let's talk about the trailer and not give Aaron Kruger all uh, the attention. The trailer was dope, as you can tell. I liked it a lot, you know what I'm saying? Uh, it looked fantastic. Um, this is the, being directed by Tim Burton. And it's cool. I mean, I think my favorite movie of his is Edward Scissorhands. If you haven't seen it, please see it now. It's fantastic. But, I mean, we all heard of Dumbo. It's a Disney film. You know, he's been around since forever. And uh, it's a great story. I like that they're filming this in the 1.85 by 1 aspect ratio. Um, that's the IMAX ratio. I don't know if they actually use IMAX cameras. Uh, but if they did, that's going to be a beautiful picture right there. Um, <clears throat> I really do like what I saw with Colin uh, Farrell in the trailer. It looked like, you know, he's going to have a serious change of heart and uh, in the film. And that's what's up. Looks like those two children, too, the boy and the girl, are going to give some pretty decent performances as well and um you know danny devito he's like an annoying character or annoying actor that i like for the most part uh you know he, I, i'm entertained by him for the most part let me see if this is gonna be film like film with extra imax 
Um, because if they do and they release that, <clears throat> excuse me, on uh, 4K, like 4K IMAX, like it's going to look better at home if you have a 4K TV than it is in a the theater. You know what I'm saying? Only reason I'm thinking about that now is because I saw that IMAX, well, the 1.85 by 1 uh, ratio. I, I know what that means. Use this uh, 2 by 39 or 2 by 2.39 or 2.40 by 1. Uh, where you have the black bars at the, the bottom and the top. But um, I don't want to just ramble, guys. The trailer is fantastic. I'm excited about this movie. Next March, can't get here fast enough. So we're going to have two Disney movies in March of next year. Um, we're going to have Captain Marvel in March. And we're also going to have Dumbo, two Disney films. I hope they're at least three weeks apart. Because... Um, Disney, y'all already made that dumbass mistake this year in 2018 by having uh, Infinity War. Uh, what was the other movie? The X-Men movie. Was there an X-Men movie that came out this year? Wait. You had Infinity War, and then you had no Deadpool 2. And then, oh, yeah, Star Wars. The Star Wars, the solo movie. Now, of course, uh, of course the um, Deadpool is Fox. But y'all could have worked something out to spread that apart. I mean, it was dumb. That's why that uh, crap fi uh, flopped. So let me look real quick. March of next year, fighting with my family. I know the church just came out. I ain't checked it out yet. Tyler Perry Mandia. Okay. the um, Let's see here. Captain Marvel is March 8th. And when is, um, what did I just see? March 29th. Okay. So I think that's at least three weeks. Let me look real quick. So March 8th, 1, 2. Yeah, that's three weeks apart. I would like a month, but, um, and you know, yeah, I would like a month, but at least three weeks is okay. And it is two different um, audiences, but those are going to be two big blockbusters. So, um, yeah, man, I wish Captain Marvel maybe came out March 1st or something like that. But, you know, we're just going to see. But, guys, that is just my opinion for the latest Dumbo trailer. What did you think? Did you like it? Did you hate it? Did I turn you on? Did I turn you off? Do you agree with me or do you disagree with me? Let me know down in the comment section below. Let's get this conversation going and keep it flowing. If you like this video, go ahead and give me that thumbs up. And if you don't, if you're not, if you don't, excuse me, that's fine. But you can still subscribe to my channel. You can also look me up on social media, Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter, all that good stuff. It's right there at the bottom of your screen, and I made it very easy by providing a link to all that good stuff down in the description box below. But guys, I just want to thank you again for tuning in to my opinion slash review slash reaction for the latest Dumbo trailer. And before you go, don't forget that my name is Brandon Keith Avery, and that's just my opinion. Peace.